Hi guys, it's another vlog today. Um, I have been so bored, okay? I'm finally going to be honest about this because well, okay, I think I'm pretty honest about it already if you follow me on Instagram or if you just know me. But guys, I hate being bored. Like, it's one of the worst things that you could do to me. And when I, like as photography slows down, I don't have another job, I'm not in school, my husband's working and I'm just at home, I am so bored and I don't know what to do with myself. You're like, do you even have friends? Yeah, I do, but my friends are all normal 21 year olds. Yeah, it's kind of difficult, but we are taking steps. I had posted it on Instagram like yesterday, kind of how I was feeling and I had a lot, was it yesterday or the day before? I think it was the day before. I had so many people like sliding up. It was so kind. If you don't follow me on Instagram, follow me on Instagram. I had so many people commenting or like messaging me and being like, yes, this is me. Like. This is what I do, and it was actually a lot of mothers, um, which was like encouraging, because I'm about to be a mother. Um, okay, I don't know if you guys can tell, look how pretty the trees are. Uh, a lot of them were like, just establish a routine, like go to Target every day, like not that you need to spend money at Target every day, but like go to Target, go to Starbucks, go to the park, you know, like get yourself to do things. So that's what we're doing right now. It is 1.17 on Friday and uh, we are headed to Goodwill 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 good oh, I'm so excited so Daniel and I have like a budgeted like amount of blow money every month and um, I already spent the majority of it on Shein yesterday for maternity clothes. I got all maternity clothes besides a pair of boots. I got a pair of boots, two maternity pants, uh, two maternity tops, and a maternity dress. And so whenever those come in in the next couple weeks, I'm gonna do a little Shein maternity haul for you guys. And I'm super excited. Um, but I still have some leftover money and I'm gonna go spend it at Goodwill. I'm so excited. We are also going to go to Starbucks because the holiday drinks are here as of yesterday. And um, we're also gonna go to Once Upon a Child. I have not been yet since being pregnant, so Lord be with me. Hopefully I don't buy the whole store. And we've made it and it looks busy, which I'm not a fan of because I hate waiting in line. Oh my gosh, my camera is bouncing. Here we are, we're gonna do it. If I get hungry, I'll get McDonald's. I'm always worried about like me getting hungry. Is that weird? We're in here. I'm looking at the dresses real quick because, okay, this is adorable. I feel like you could wear this with like a cardigan and like boots. A lot of times when I'm at Goodwill, if you've watched me for a while, you know that I just grab anything and then think about it later. So I have $47 to spend, guys, so gonna be a little bit of a challenge today. Oh, it's from American Eagle. Guys, I'm already scoring. My man Posty's playing, ready? He follows me everywhere I go, I love him. Okay, before I get super into clothes, I am going to check out the furniture real quick because my friend Nicole has been looking for a dresser. So I'm going to just check on that real quick. Okay, so I usually look in all the sizes, but I think since I'm not really gonna fit in small sizes anymore, I'm just gonna be looking in the larger sections um, than my regular size. Yeah. And that'll also save a little time, so. Okay, we've looked through the shirts. I found 
Here's a quick thing. Three. Thank you. Two sweaters. Quick, thank you so very much. Um, because whatever you buy now we're looking today, at pants. Whatever you donate. I'm curious whatever if they have round like up a to size a 10. We're using what you give us well, to improve your community. Yet. For example, I think we I could fit into like a size 4, six. New moms, families, six. And babies. A healthier, stronger stomach. Jean, and so it'd be super again, cheap here. Real quick here. Thank Without, you, thank you like, while I'm waiting for my maternity good, good, good stuff and good prices. No, uh, good cause. There probably isn't any. I'm not seeing any. Okay, now I'm gonna add up everything and see how much it is. I also found these shoes. Okay, so that was $40, which means I'm gonna skim through the picture frames and home stuff. Sorry, you can't see me. If there's anything I want, I'll snag it. If not, I'm gonna get in line. We are out of there, and I'm thinking about going home, actually, and waiting to go to Once Upon a Child and stuff until Daniel's off work. I feel like that's something I should do with him. Not that I have to, but it, you know, be fun. <sighs> so, and my head hurts. Pretty bad, actually. Okay, now that I'm home and just washed down about a third of a bag of Doritos, I'm gonna show you guys what I got. So, who was texting me? Oh no. <laughs> hmm. I shouldn't be laughing. Reports, Tiger King star Joe Exotic says he has a very aggressive prostate cancer. I didn't think that was what was going to take out Joe. Anyways, um, so I got, the, I got these pair of shoes and I, know, I can tell that they're from Walmart because it's the Athletic Works brand, which I love. <laughs> Their memory foam is so comfortable. Don't believe me? Go to Walmart and buy a pair of shoes. Um, and it's like a beige cream color. I don't know how well you can tell with like the light. This is originally from American Eagle, but it's just a turtleneck dress. I wish that the cut was a little bit different. I think it'll be a good classic with my belly. This is originally from Target. I don't mean to just pick up things from stores I already know. It just kind of happens. Um, but this is actually a 2XL, which is not my size, but I thought it looked so comfortable. It's a romper and I can wear like a big sweater under it and like tights and boots and a cardigan, doing jacket, like whatever. So I just thought that was really really cute and then i got this long sleeve just you know classic type of shirt like this that i think will be long enough to go over my belly fingers crossed if i don't crop it before then and i found a couple sweaters this one's a turtleneck kind of like a charcoal it might have been black at one point but i think it's lived a few lives um but I really like it. It's a bigger sweater. And then this sweater, which is from Fashion Nova originally. Super cute also. It's got the balloon sleeves. Oh, it's got some tears in it. Do I care? No. And then last but not least, these are the jeans I said I shouldn't get because they're probably only gonna fit me for like a month. Um, but because they're only one size bigger than I usually wear before I got pregnant but they're brand new H&M jeans like what? they're like boyfriend style high rise should the I try them on and see head. if I can even fit in them now like am I underestimating my bod check it oh my gosh we're gonna try them on and see but I also have to dookie so i gotta hurry all right so somebody in my facebook page told me not to do this and now i see why yeah they don't fit at all there's no you use that cool technique <laughs> that i could but technique. also it's really tight on my butt which just means that something's gotten fatter 
just like I thought. I think all my weight has literally been going to my woman goods, which is great, but also I am not gonna fit in things the same way anymore. I just know it, which is okay. That is super tight on my bum. I don't know if you can tell. And I can't even. You shouldn't suffocate her like that. No. I did. It's You're honestly... pushing her back down. Take her off. <laughs> I'm laughing. I can't. Oh my god, it's so tight. I can't even unbutton it. Oh my well, god. Now you're stuck in it. Sorry. <laughs> I'm not helping. You don't want to help? I can't. I literally can't get this one done. Uh. <sighs> Back on. The sweatpants go. Hello. Daniel's joined us now. And it's a couple hours later. We are. Uh, we are headed to Starbucks and then once upon a child we may also if it's time uh, we'll head over to my parents Daniel's going to Brown County tomorrow to hang out with some boys and fish and my dad is lending him the pole and so we gotta go get it and then we might pick up some food have a little date night at home and watch the new episode of the Great British Vacation Channel. Thank you. Thank you. Have a lovely day. How will you too? Okay, we've made it. The Jungle Bills look so sketchy. I, all these look so sketchy. I've got my drink. It's an iced peppermint mocha decaf with oat milk. It's like an Andes or something. It's delicious. How do you not like that? Because I don't really like Andes to oh. start off. I'm always holding like way too many things. Okay, we're in here. I'm honestly a little overwhelmed. We just walked in and I'm already overwhelmed. Found it. The mother load. Mommy's mini. She's not gonna look like me. She's gonna look exactly like you. I'm calling it now. Okay. I'm going to show you guys everything we got. Ralphie! Here, chicken, chicken. Ralphie, come here, bunny. Ralphie. We're at my mom's. Okay, time for a little haul. So, she's her due date is in March, so it'll still be a little cold. Starting to get warm, so we did get some warm things, and these are all zero to three months. This is six months. But generally, zero to three months. It's just this little white vest and it's got little ears on it. Daniel picked out this poncho, which honestly will be so cute with just some like leggings and like booties. I got her some staples. Miss Thing got a cardigan, a beige cream cardigan. She also got a jean jacket because you know, jean jacket. These two things are from H&M. This is just like a little brown long sleeve with little buttons, so cute. This is also from H&M. This is a long sleeve onesie. It's got like speckles on it. It's not quite polka dots. It's like the speckles, you know? And then last but not least, we just got these like little bloomy shorts. Super cute. Alrighty. Yeah, I wonder who they're playing. So my dad just gave Daniel the crash course, which Daniel's fished before, but it's been like a year and you know, every pole's different. And every lure is different. I'm more of a, I'm more of a bobber fisher, you know, he'd, back in the day he just said, uh, and then you just uh, and you said, anyway. Anyway. <laughs> You'll be an active fisher. Oh my God. Um, so we've got the pole, some lures, some extra string. I'm gonna lose my mind when I catch fish, you know. Don't forget to turn on the lights. I think you got it. But now fish out! Fish out! We are going to get to play, hopefully. I'm gonna call my mommy back. <sighs> and welcome to Southport Chick fil A, one of the busiest in Indiana. There's three lanes. And it 
wrapped around the building twice. But they do a good job and goes decently fast for the circumstances. So I'm really hungry, but I just gotta. Okay, and we got it. Wow. All right, we've made it home. We're just gonna chill out, watch the Great British Baking Show, and go to sleep. Daniel's gonna be gone all day tomorrow. I might end the vlog in the morning. Um, yeah, delicious. Good morning, guys. I just want to be thankful for the few people that watch my videos. Um, it's easy to like get discouraged that I don't have very many people watching my videos and stuff, but like, I don't care. I'm so happy to like look back on these years from now, just like how I look, I rewatch my college ones, like my freshman year of college. And it's just so, un <clears throat> and it's just so entertaining and fun to see how I've grown. And I know that it's going to be the same thing with this so i'm very grateful for you that let me know that you're supporting me and watching me every step of the way i love you guys a lot um daniel's in brown county right now uh and i just have some stuff i gotta get done today sarah's coming over and bringing me starbucks and company um so i'll i will be all right but um Thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe, follow me on Instagram, and just keep along if you'd like. Love you.